Hello, Palominos. My name is Jesus Huerta, and I will be guiding you today through this presentation. I will be talking about the different hacks that you as a student can find in LCC. To be able to receive these hacks, you will first need to get your student ID that you can get at the Office of Student Life at the Cajun Student Center in room 214. The things you will need in order to receive your Palomino ID will be your class receipt that you get in the bursar's office and any kind of picture ID. Moving on, let me explain to you all the things you can find in your passport. Passport is the website where you can view your registration status, degree PAL, and Canvas. Once you're logged into your passport, you can click on the tab that says Students and you will be able to find all of the links to the names listed above. Degree PAL is a system where you can find how you're doing throughout the semesters. It shows you all of the classes you've taken and the ones you're still missing from completing your degree. The one underneath the Degree PAL is Canvas, which is where you can find all the classes you're currently taking. With this link, you are able to view your grades, assignments, and you can message your instructors or classmates for any questions or concerns. Under the column Registration Tools, you have the option of either adding or dropping a class after meeting with an advisor, which can save you time from the long lines in enrollment and registration. Another resource that you can find under the Students tab is My Finances, which gives you all the information regarding your semester balance and financial aid status. If you did not know, LCC has a few apps that makes it easier for you to view any kind of information you may need. The first one is the LCC app, which is a general app of what you can find in your passport. You can also find the map of both campuses and even events that will be held during the semester. The second app is the LCC libraries, where you can find the books that you will need for your assignments, along with any information about the library as to how you can contact them. Now the last one is the Canvas app, which has the same information as the website, however is easier to access no matter where you are. If you want to save some time from the lines in advising, you can go to the link provided to you on the screen and fill out the form in order to speak to the advisor and get the classes needed for the semester. LCC offers a website called Upswing where you can find online tutors for different subjects where they can help you check your assignments and let you know of any errors you might have. The Career Placement Inventory helps you decide what kind of career is best fit for you by giving you links where you can take tests and find out about your working field. LCC also has Campus Police which offers certain services for students. For example, they can help you with air or battery assistance. In addition, Campus Police assists in case you leave your keys inside your car. They can pop the car open, however they are not responsible for any damages made to your car. For any student who stays in late campus, they can escort you to your car or classes if you feel uncomfortable walking by yourself in the, in the dark. If you find yourself walking late outside and have an emergency, look for our red stations where you will press a button and the alarm will sound off and Campus Police will arrive. Note that the emergency stations are only for emergencies. The final service that they offer is this lost and found service where you might find any lost items in campus. The contact information for the main campus is P64 and the phone number is 956-721-5303. Again, that's 956-721-5303. And for the South Campus, it is Protective Services and the phone number is 956-794-4303. If you are ever feeling active, LCC offers you several locations where you can spend some free time while being active. We have the pool open for students, however for the schedule you would have to contact the kinesiology department in case of any changes to the schedule. The campus also provides the students with two recreational centers, one located in the Maravillo gym and the other located in the Dliac building. Both buildings consist of a weight and cardio room. Another thing are the track fields, which are only located in the main campus behind the LIAC. The soccer fields can be found in both campuses along the newly opened game room at the south campus. The main campus also has a tennis court, which is also found behind the LIAC. The game room in the main campus allows students to relax during a class break. 
The game room has pool tables, ping pong tables, foosball, Xbox, and an air hockey. The Learning Enrichment Center offers study rooms, tutors, testing centers, computer labs, course textbooks, student supportive services, and printing services. The contact information for the main campus is in the Memorial Hall in room 235, and the number is 956-721-5348. For the South Campus, it is in the Learning Center in room 208, and the number is 794-4348. The e-learning center is located at the LIAC third floor and the number is 721-5211. This department offers computers, webcams, and headphones to all students. Other services that they offer are internet navigation orientation, help desk, testing center, online questionnaire to conclude if you should or should not take online courses, computer labs, and printing services. For students, for students who are registered for online classes, you can stop by the office to check out a laptop for free. However, you have to go as soon as the semester starts because there is a first come first serve process, it is a limited quantities, and you must be taking an online class and present a picture ID. Some computer labs that are located in the campus are in the Atkins building in room 210, and the Memorial Hall in room 240 and 241, and the LIAC, which is in the third floor, and the Enrollment and Registration, which is in the Lerma Peña building in room 116, and in the Hatcher Vocational in room 116. If you have a refund, you can use this to purchase a book off campus. You only need to stop by the Office of Financial Aid and take a textbook price quote from the seller. If you qualify, your money from your refund will be used to purchase the book. If you happen to not have enough money to pay for your classes, you can stop by the bursar's office and ask for an installment plan. With this plan, you will be able to keep your classes throughout the whole semester while still paying for them. Lastly, we have the Environmental Center. This consists of different representations of organisms around our area, which include different plants and animals. For LCC or TAMU students, all you would need would be your student ID for a free admission. The hours are from Monday to Thursday from 8 a.m. to 6 p.m., and on Fridays from 8 a.m. to 12 p.m. And the phone number is 956-764-5701. The admission for general public is $4, and for children it's $2. So we thank you for listening, and we hope to see you soon around campus. Green out, Palominos.